Good morning and welcome to WSRH News, your leading source for news at Seminole Ridge High. I'm Kira Taub. And I'm Maisie Contessa. Today is Tuesday, October 22nd. We've got a lot to tell you about this morning, but first, today's top story. Today is day two of homecoming week. Today's theme is teachers versus students. WSRH News reporter Peyton Tiemann has the story. Today's our second week of homecoming spirit week. The theme is teacher versus students. Let's go see who all dressed up. This week is homecoming week and on Thursday SGA is having their annual homecoming carnival that will take place from 4 to 7 p.m. The carnival is free to attend as well as Improv Club's debut show which will be in the auditorium from 4.30 to 5.30 p.m. There will be a hypnotist show at 7 p.m. which is free with the purchase of a homecoming ticket or $5 upon entry. The carnival will have food trucks, games, and so much more. Hope to see you there. If you want to go to homecoming and don't have a ticket yet, hurry up. Today and Thursday are the last days homecoming tickets are on sale. Stop by the table at A and B lunch with your signed contract and $30 to buy your ticket. Starting last Friday, SGA is hosting a pumpkin hunt around campus. Pumpkins are hidden all around the school. When you find a pumpkin, bring it to Mr. Crimmins' room in 6101 during A lunch for a reward. Happy hunting! Attention students, the class of 2028 is excited to announce the sale of Boo Grams. These spooky treats will be available to purchase from October 28th to the 30th during both lunches. Send the boo gram to your friends, which will be delivered on October 31st. Each gram costs just $2 and includes a lollipop and a personalized note. This Friday, SGA will be hosting this year's homecoming pep rally. If you wish to attend, you must sign up using the Google form and have a 2.2 GPA. If you have any questions, email Mr. Crimmins or stop by room 6101. If you wish to retake your yearbook picture, today's the day in room 7110. You must have permission from your teacher to attend. Our ceramics program is selling Krispy Kreme donuts from today to October 25th. You can order from any ceramics student or go to room 3101 and order with Ms. Berg. Donut pickup will be in room 3101 on October 30th. Must have money at time of order. Calling all seniors. There is a college and career corner tomorrow at 6 to 7 p.m. This is to get ready to pass the SAT. Come on out if you are interested. Our Spanish Honor Society is also selling their famous flower grams, celebrating the people in our lives that make us feel special. Flowers are going to be sold during lunches A and B. You can personalize your message to brighten someone's day. They will be delivered during the recipient's fifth period class, October 30th or 31st. Don't forget to bring a dollar if you want to get one. Tomorrow we will have our first hot card giveaway in the cafeteria during both lunches. You must bring your hot card to the table in the back to receive your treat. Those of you taking ACE Classical Studies exam this Thursday, please ensure you come to Ms. Palfrey's room for a lunch. You will be provided with lunch and Ms. Palfrey has a surprise for all students taking the test. Good luck! Congratulations to this week's Hawk of the Week. Ninth grade Hawk is Axel Vassilotti, nominated by Ms. Green. Tenth grade Hawk is Amelia Smith, nominated by Ms. Habegger. Eleventh grade Hawk, Max Single, nominated by Ms. R. Pelfrey. And twelfth grade Hawk, Jakira Barnett, nominated by Ms. Brand. Good job, Hawk. Students were nominated based on academic excellence, academic improvement, or for their efforts in making our campus better by doing things like helping others, volunteering their time, or even simply picking up trash. Coming up on WSRH News, weather and birthdays. Plus sports. The youth make up a great majority of voters and offer a unique perspective on our nation's values. Your opinion matters, and as the heart of our nation, it is important that your voice is heard. The future of our nation is in your hands, which is why it's important you register to vote. Go to registertovoteflorida.gov and fill out the form, print it, and mail it to your local election office. And be sure to visit your local polling station this November and cast your vote. Hey Kira, when is a boat just like snow? When? When it's adrift. <laughs> Let's go to WSRH meteorologist Lily Grosso with today's forecast. Today's forecast is a high of 85 and a low of 73 with sunny skies. For our three-day forecast, starting with Wednesday, is a high of 84 and a low of 70 with sunny skies. For Thursday, is a high of 83 and a low of 68 with sunny skies. For Friday, is a high of 84 and a low of 68 with cloudy skies. And that's it for WSRH weather. I'm Lily Grosso. 
We have a happy birthday going out to Christopher Zambito, Sienna Bermudez, Jessa Reeves, and Ernest Acosta. Happy birthday. WS3 Sports anchor Julian Caboose Barona joins us now at the sports desk. Good morning, Hawks. We have a lot to talk about today, so let's get started. Last night, our undefeated JV football team went up against the undefeated Glade Central Raiders, and the Hawks came out victorious. The Hawks defeated the Raiders 12 to 8 to finish their season undefeated. Congratulations to the JV football team. Today, starting at 5, Summoner Ridge is hosting our annual Powder Puff game. This is a homecoming tradition here at the Ridge where teams of girls from each grade level face off in an epic flag football tournament. WSRH reporter Hani Almasudi has more information on the story. to talk about the Powder Puff game. So, one is hot. Powder Puff game is tonight. It starts at 5 o'clock p.m. We're really excited to get started. The first game we have going on is our freshmen taking on juniors. So make sure you're out there by five o'clock so you can catch that first game. How have you guys like been preparing for the end? So every class does their own preparations. So for the, the football games, you know, every class has gotten their teams together. They practice a little bit on their own. We kind of practice this past Saturday for all the teams to together and do it. So all the teams have been getting together, kind of running some plays, keeping it basic. But at the end of the day, it's just all about homecoming fun and getting into the spirit of peace. Are you guys that fun of the game? Absolutely, we're gonna have fun with the game. Make sure you guys come out. Okay, tickets are available on GoFan, so go on there and buy it. When you're at the game, there's gonna be a concession available, some candy, some, some soda, some chips. Um, you know, just make sure you have cash, bring it, but come out and support your classmates and have fun this upcoming week. Hey, get to tell what's up with us. I'm on Alan Street. Taking a look at today's sports calendar, boys and girls bowling districts at Jupiter Bolero at 3 p.m. Good luck, Hawks. Well, that's it for WSRH Sports. I'm Julian Caboose Barona. News, I'm Maisie Contessa. And I'm Kira Tog. Remember that you can follow us on social media on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube at Summoner Ridge TV. Have a great day, Hawks.